On behalf of the couple, I welcome you to the celebration of love and ask that you please take a moment to silence your mobile devices. I'd also like to remind everyone to toss the Waking up at dawn Breezes blowing cool and strong The breeze you could fly Brittany. I'm Hannah's matron of honor, oldest, and of course her favorite sister. I was one of the first people that Hannah came out to in our family. I was proud that she was able to finally live her true self. When everyone else told her it was just a phase, I remember telling her that I will always support her no matter what. Me and Hannah may not have started out as close as we are now. As we got older, we hung out a lot more and realized that if she or I had a secret or exciting news that we wanted to share, we wanted each other to be the first to know. I definitely miss her just showing up and walking into my house and popping down on the couch when she lived closer, but I don't miss her leaving every cabinet and every drawer open. <laughs> you look very nice. <laughs> Thanks. You look good yourself. <laughs> She will ever, forever try and prove herself correct when you argue with her. Sarah, be prepared to just for her to blurt out, Google it, to try and prove herself. If she doesn't already do that. <laughs> Out of all the stories that Hannah has told me, the one story that I believed was the conversation we had about the fact that she knew she was going to marry you. She told me that it just feels different with her and that she's never felt this way about anyone. She never saw a future with anyone like she could with you. She did have a suspicion that you were looking at rings, which was funny because you and I were in a private chat at the same time talking about which ring you should pick out for her and how you plan on asking her. To know where we belong and to know it truly No sticks to both, I'm coming in. Deep into me, it's a wild and worthy so I am Julia, and I have had the most honorable pleasure of knowing Sarah since we were seven. So 20 years, so I just aged us. We were not friends at first sight. I had to literally annoy her to talk to me. Thank you for being such a good friend over the years. And just knowing what kind of friend you are to me, I know you're gonna be the best friend to Hannah and the absolute best soulmate. And I'm just so, so happy for you. This was really, really hard for me to write. <laughs> because I've been dreaming about this moment since we were little and I've just wanted it to be perfect. Sarah, I think that 13 year old us would be so proud of us right now. We'd be so proud of how far that you've come. We never dreamed we'd actually find love like this because I don't think we ever had the opportunity to see it until we felt it. <laughs> I remember the first time I imagined today as a possibility. It was significantly faster than the average human would envision their marriage with somebody. However, everyone here knows that it's not a surprise that I fell for you so fast. I'm kind of a hopeless romantic. And you, I mean, look at you. <laughs> it does. It's so nice. I like this. Do a spin. This is not what I imagined. Sarah and Sailor, today I make all my scary statements reality. This crazy connection you and I have will finally be forever. This is it, like I said before. All the laughs, all the memories, every lesson I've learned along the way has helped me be confident in saying that I love you. I vow to love you on days I don't love anything. I vow to always think you're the greatest thing I've ever seen walk this earth. I vow to love you even when you're old and gray. I vow to listen to you more. I'm not very good at that. <laughs> I vow to be your biggest and most annoying support. I vow to give you a family. I vow to be intentional with my love for you, and I vow to love you even when you don't love anything either. I vow to continue my work to work on myself to be the best version I can be. I never, I never have been a super decisive person. I think it's just part of who I am. But the decision to love you on the other hand, that's the easiest decision I've ever made. Our journey began in a beer garden in Indianapolis on a Sunday afternoon. Two strangers meeting for the first time, compliments of the universe. 
Chapters rolled in quickly after that. We had pages of We're Just Friends chapters before we ever got to the I Think I Like Her ones. These pages kept me on my toes and I spent a lot of my time wondering if and when I would risk ruining our friendship to tell you that my perspective was shifting and you were no longer a friend to me. It took a while, but eventually we got to the page where I had to tell you how I feel, leading to our favorite laughable quote, I know you like me and I like you, so what are we gonna do about it? <laughs> From moving to Indy solo and starting her own business, there's truly nothing she can't do. And I'm so glad she has her person to do all these adventures with in the future. My favorite thing about you two is that you love to explore and continue to grow. It's so important. So turns out, <laughs> so turns out I won't marry a blonde haired, blue eyed man like my younger self always thought. <laughs> turns out I get to marry a sassy, smart, loving, blonde haired, green eyed, badass woman. And I could not be more proud. I'm so happy for our unexpected love story. You may now seal your commitment to each other with a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> My great honor to introduce to you for the very first time, Mrs. and Mrs. Taylor! So I just found out a couple of days ago that I was supposed to do a speech. I did uh, and then I see people looking at the phone, I didn't know that was an option. <laughs> <laughs> So first of all, you know, Hannah, you're a sailor now. I mean, there's a lot that goes with that. Uh, and it, but it's official and it's a, not, not because of this wedding so much is it official, but I do want to let you know that a couple days ago, I bought and had delivered a Christmas stocking with, with an H on it, which, I've been very protective of that. The kids, have, they've had significant others and I have never done that, but you're, <laughs> you're in now. <laughs> Sarah's been full of surprises the last several years. <laughs> you look beautiful. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. Yeah. It looks awesome. Yeah. Like even, going on with this yeah. Thread. Fairly recently, seems like real recently, she had a real big surprise. <laughs> she told me about Hannah. <laughs> that was a big surprise. Sarah together and I've never seen Sarah happier or at peace 